Welcome to Insurrection Field in Brain, Washington, BS, home of the Cadavers. The Cadavers? What creative genius came up with that name? Well, when a team asks the biggest MFL star announcer what he thinks the team should be named, he gives his opinion. Well, in my opinion, the only name more stupid would be the Commanders. <laughs> Suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's gonna have it all. The New York Tyrants go up against the Brain Washington Cadavers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Bricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Opa! Uh -huh. It's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo, stick your head in the toaster oven, that'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And it's first and ten. They call the war speed dirty brick. He's so fast he wants his 60. Oh, and he brings free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. my friends, was an all-pro MFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. That's a four-yard game. Second down and six. Hot one, hot two, hot Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in palm print. The cross stitching, unbelievable. And he snares the punt and looks for open field. Hey, the dog thing snares. He got it. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Understand why refs are hated even more than kickers? <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. And this is a first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. 
Well, you can check dead ref off your mutant bingo card at home. One down. <laughs> it didn't take long. <laughs> First down and forever. It's a glitterception. What's that, Grim? Oh, with the brutal hit. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? First down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, the strawberry field's dirty trick. There was an explosion, but everyone's walking away from it. Them cool guys always walk away from explosions. Hey, that might be good for the movies, but it's awful for the MFL. First down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Ouch! Anyone in the mood for a steak tartare? Oh, he almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big porta John in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. Don't nobody light a match. Second down in a lot. Hot one, hot two, hot. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. See that, boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And that'll be second and eight to go. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Third down and three. Runs it for three. Hold everything. They're going for it on fourth down. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yes, I think so. And it's first and ten. Pull that about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, he 
was hitting mid hurdle and fumbles the ball. Third down and never going to happen. hit that was and that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size because he just walked all over him boring but smart time to punt whoa whoa you can't say that on the radio nice punt should move him back nicely he's got the ball now and is going to try and score oh that's a vicious hit and the crowd loves it he just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny and you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Hot one, hot two. Eight. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the eye. And this game is up for grabs. Second down and more than the QB would like. One, hot two, eight. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. One, hot two, hot three. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. First down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against it. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. First down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot two. He's supercharged and can electrocute any opposing player. The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. Trim your nostril hairs once and for all. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot eight. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Comes the extra point attempt. It's good. Suited that I'm ready for war. I'll put the back. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Yeah, a lot of guys talk about step 
stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the ground crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten. Loses your brain and loses your brain on berserker drugs. Is that, is that guy's brain? Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. <laughs> Second and three. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And he picks up maybe four on that play. <laughs> Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And we're at the two-minute warning. I gotta pee. Ghost. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. sandwich the defense calls their first time out to save some clock i save clocks too grim my wife hates them they take up the whole garage wait what you're married uh, it's complicated he boomed that one let's see if they can get a return nice catch and he turns on the afterburners put returners in this league oh he just got crushed First and ten. That's a four yard gain. Second down and six. for a first down to keep the drive alive. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Ah, that's okay, Grim. Thank you that line. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. And I don't want 
to see the comment section on that replay of the kick. Yeesh. That was terrible. Yeah, he's going to get the right fuck-up treatment after that miss. Hot. Hot one. They've got one more time on left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Grim, can I kill him? That's a catch for a 10-yard game. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, uh, I'm going to a strapeze show. Where are we going? Yeah. Hey, once you settle down, just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. And he's off to the races. Oh, you see that saw, Bricks? He never saw that. I saw what you saw. A saw you never saw. See, there's the saw there. I see. You never know. And it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. How have they not killed him yet? He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy grin. the first and long and the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref they say we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore <laughs> first down in a mile Offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. That yeah, is still edible, though. Just got to scrape off the charge parts. Second down in a lot. Boom! Third and four. Much like my wedding night, there was a big explosion, but then everyone left disappointed. Everyone? You had more than two people in the room? Yeah, the guy filming. 
Lola and the Clown. Somebody's got to make the balloon animals. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. First and ten. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and seven. warming up. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. It's good. If you don't kill this ref with the attack ref dirty trick, you're going to lose, pal. You kind of deserve it if you're this damn scrim. They are going for it, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. A nice run for five yards. Third down and five. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was! And it's...
It's first and ten. And these guys are marching down the field unopposed. Man, the defense looks clueless out there. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you shut him on the bench. At some point, they're going to need to put this rip out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance, if you hit the dirty tricks and pass the rim? I want him to get out of Second down in a muffin says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And the ref runs out of bounds and manages to survive somehow. Yeah, at least for another 40 seconds. Second down and, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Third down and forever. They just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. leaving a wake of destruction in his path and the body toll continues to climb the offense is down to their last running back when he bites the dust they can only pass yeah well at least they don't have to forfeit man that's right but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers and that'll be second and eight to go His ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All we need is 77 to bite him. any mistakes here just kick the ball through the upright for god's sake the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies here comes the kicker oh, i can't wait to hear this what's the kicker grim uh, this guy in the field oh i thought you were gonna tell me a story like here's the kicker when i turned out the light it wasn't a broad in my bed it was a chip wearing a wig First and ten. Oh, 
great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. He had it for a second there. Third down and 10. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. They've used a strawberry field's dirty trick. <laughs> Those guys don't. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Second down and ten. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag! He's killing me in the fantasy league. Third down and ten. one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Hold on. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Only two minutes left in the game. <laughs> Second.
second down in a lot. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. The QB looks angry at his offensive line, and I can't blame him. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And up comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Apparently the punter for the day is being played by my kid's sister, and she doesn't have what? And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. That's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And we are all tied up and we're going to overtime. Go ahead and cancel that quality time with the family and continue to stream at your television. This is going to be great. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. First down! He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. for the first down. And it's first and ten. And the ball is lateral to it. You can't keep a good mutant down. Someone tell the defense their job is to stop the offense. And it's first and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. He is fighting for every yard. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs.
first down and six. A pickup of about three on that play. Second and three. and come away victorious. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? Well, I paid for admission. I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, man, I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Eagle SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every